All right, those are done. Time to paint some more. So I'm gonna need to get these painted and more of those built because if I go ahead and set that, then I lose my building space. That's the biggest part. I'm building space. Then eventually for the next two, I'm gonna have to move all this and that probably. God, I don't even know. Another full day of painting in the books. Just in the nick of time. Rack number two. Second set squared up. Third rack painted. Third set, squared up. Now I gotta get these legs painted. The fish barn is an absolute wreck right now. Getting it done though. Legs have been painted. Now to drill them, screw them, and get them put on. Some of the plywood cut and sanded. I gotta tarp it over so it doesn't get wet. You never know when it's going to rain down here. But my van only holds so many pieces of plywood, so I got to drive an hour back an hour back and forth at least three times just for plywood. But I don't know what I'm going to do with all this scrap. First set of tops done. Rest acquired. Each shelf needs one full piece. Cut. Got one done. Moved it all the way over. This is gonna be a squeeze, just running out of room. And then all this, I gotta move all this stuff too. Oh boy. I can no longer get out the back door right now. Managed to get two of them up, but I cannot get a ladder between this space and this space and build the next one. So, to even get to the third one I gotta build here to have space to build it because that's like the only flat spot that doesn't have a lot of dips and divots. This concrete floor is not even. I've gotta move all this. There is a ton ton of just scrap miscellaneous pieces of wood and plywood and everything else i have no space for it on top of everything over here so this all has to get moved and the only spot to really put that right now is literally in the middle of the fish room it's where i build i'm gonna have to probably build on top of it so finding space could be the hardest part when you're doing this kind of stuff. I do have space where I can put a lot of this stuff, but later after I get the tanks out for the rack, so it's just like move this for that, move this for that, and then back, and it's just, it seems excessive. I wish I already had space, but it is, you gotta use what you can. Oh my goodness, look at these guys. Beautiful barbs. They're just waking up too. That's why they're so slow. Usually they're zipping. Other boards cut, sanded, painted. Still got another round of six of these to do. But now I've got to move all that stuff. So, boom. Friday night after the live stream. Do it. Just for reference, this is what was in that pile. 
It's all nothing but little scrap everywhere. I'm barely even touching it. Goes all the way down. What to do with all this? It's all good stuff. Hate to throw it out, but. Grind, grinding. All right, doesn't look like much, but pretty much cleared out for the most part, reorganized. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna move all this stuff tomorrow when it's light out, cause it's like past midnight right now, but Ryan will continue till the next one. Thank you all so much for the support. I gotta get a little rest for tomorrow and hit the ground running. Do more painting. I still got this fourth rack to build too. I would like to get that built by this weekend. Hopefully, we'll see. Which I still have to buy the tops for those. But my goal, at least for the end and next week video that you guys will see, is to have the four racks done with the tops. And hopefully, maybe some tanks.